so it's me Sarah again and I am back with a I think I'm going to title this as a get ready with me because I'm getting ready to go to school right now so, sorry it's been like a week since I last posted I just started school I know I said that I would be back to my my regular posting schedule and all that crap or whatever but um I don't know I just kind of wanted to settle into school but uh, everything's good uh, I've just been working in school and stuff so yeah but anyways um, I just kind of based this look off my shirt today this is a Wonder Years shirt the Wonder Years album just came out today and today is the I got it the other day um, I was actually looking for a present for Evan but I ended up getting this shirt instead because I don't know it was on sale 4th so September 4th their album No Closer to Heaven came out and they're my favorite band so and I just got this new shirt so I was like might as well wear it today so yeah I kinda just did a makeup look based on this shirt which I thought was really cool. Hey, let me know what you guys want to see next I definitely am interested in doing like a Q&A so leave your questions cause I'd like to do one. Um, anyways I love you guys, and until next time, I'll see y'all later. Be sure to subscribe, comment, all that fun stuff, and follow me on my social medias, so that way we can, you know, interact and all that fun stuff. So, anyways, enjoy the tutorial. Bye! Hey guys, so like anybody, I have to get ready for school. So, um, first I'm going to just start off with my eyes today. I'm using my NYX Jumbo Eye Pencil in Milk, and I'm just going to use that as my base today. I feel like changing it up and also I wanted it to, to pop the main eyeshadow of this look to make it a little bit more bright. Now I'm going to take my Lorac Pro Metals palette and I'm taking the shade Clover which is like a taupey green color um, and just applying it all over my lid today. To kind of blend in our crease, I'm just taking this um, like brownish light nude shade, if that makes sense, by or from uh, the Chi Chi Mattes palette, and I'm blending that into my crease, just kind of adding some brown in there to change up the look. Now, from the same Chi Chi palette, I'm taking this like army green color, and then I'm applying it to like my outer crease and then I'm going to end up blending that into the lighter green. Then of course I'm taking my favorite Makeup Geek eyeshadow brush and blending all those colors together. Now from the same Laura Pro palette I'm taking the color Onyx which is a black like sparkly uh, color. It's really opaque. I really like it. And I'm just adding that into my crease. Just packing on the color first and then I'm going to end up blending it out. But just focusing into that little corner area like that. And then I'm taking again that same uh, Makeup Geek brush and then I'm blending that kind of into my crease lightly. on to my face. I'm just priming my face with my um, Smashbox um, primer. I think I used my primer water today. I just don't know why I didn't get it on camera. So I'm just putting that all over my face. And then today the foundations I'm using are the two Fit Me, the Matte and Poreless and the Dewy Smooth. I am in shade 112 of Natural Ivory for the Matte and Poreless. And then for the Dewy Smooth, I'm 120 Classic Ivory. And I kind of just mix them together and put them all over my face and then obviously blend out with my beauty blender. Now 
to conceal today, I did use my MAC Pro Longwear um, found, not foundation, duh, uh, concealer. I forget what color it is, but it'll be listed down below. And I kind of just skipped some steps just because I pretty much do the same thing in every video. Like, I set it with my Kat Von D like, powder and then, um, you know, I do the rest of my face or whatever, the same. And then I'm just kind of lining the bottom of my eyes with the leftover like product on my brushes just to add some depth and then now I'm gonna do my eyebrows really quick nothing really special there if you guys want like a specific eyebrow tutorial let me know but like I said I do it the same in like every video so I'm not really gonna go over it again Now for some reason I didn't get this on camera, but I am using the Kat Von D Metals Eyeshadow in Thunderstruck for my highlight today. And then I'm blending it with a Morphe brush, which I forget the name of, that will be listed down below. And then I did my eyeliner with my Kat Von D of course, and then now I'm just using my MAC Zoom Lash and then my Falsies Mascara for my mascara today. And after that, um, I think I just basically finished off the rest of my face. And you should be about done. Uh, for lips today, I use my Chicor Chicory Lip Liner with Diva Lipstick. So, after that, you're pretty much done. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed this look. I really liked it. I think it looks really nice. So, let me know what you guys think below. Be sure to subscribe as well. And I have some good things coming in the future. So, keep up with me. Follow me on my social media. And until next time, I'll see you guys later. Bye! Also, forgot to mention, I'm setting my lipstick with just a translucent powder just to make it stay longer. Anyways, bye for real this time.